end product of sausage rolls and scotch eggs. Well guys, something's wrong. I woke up this morning feeling like something was missing in my life, like there was some sort of imbalance in the universe, and uh, after a couple hours of soul searching, I know what it is. It has been nearly three months since I have made a video on none other than Kay's cooking, and that, my friends, will leave a hole in your heart. So today, I plan on mending it. Now what reminded me of my shortcomings was about a week ago, I got a message on Instagram asking me to check out one of Kay's older videos. Now after I watched this video, I thought to myself, wow, this person DMing me must not be an OG fan because I've already covered this. So I went through my channel trying to find it to send it back to them, and, well, I couldn't find it. Somehow, the video Sausage Roll and Scotch Eggs slipped right past me and I have no idea how. Because when I searched this video on YouTube to look at it, I had watched the entire thing already. So one of three things must have happened here. Either a higher power possessed me when I first saw this and prevented me from turning it into a video, somebody logged into my account and deleted the video while I wasn't looking, or, and maybe the most likely, I'm just an idiot and I think I've gone through every case cooking video I made, but I actually haven't, and I'm about to make a duplicate video. Either way, this monstrosity of a recipe deserves to be talked about, even if it's for the second time. Let's begin. Please subscribe. Hi people, and I'm back cooking again. And today I'm going to do a double. I'm going to do scotch eggs and sausage rolls. Alrighty, so I am from the US of A, so I had no idea what a scotch egg was. Did a little bit of googling, and uh, I've got to be honest, I'm not sure if these sound very appetizing to me, even if they were made well. If you're also unfamiliar with the scotch egg, it's a boiled egg wrapped in sausage meat, coated in breadcrumbs, and then deep fried or baked, aka what I have to imagine is the driest thing on the planet. To me, this seems like one of those recipes that is probably delicious if you do it perfectly, but if you don't get it quite right, it's not going to be too enjoyable. The thing is about sausage rolls, I make them every time around about Christmas time. And the problem I have, and Leo back me up, is I put too much sausage meat in and my sausage rolls come open. Don't they, Lee? Or are you always too drunk to know? My god, Kay, you did not need to put Lee on blast like that. If your son has a problem, you need to be there to support him. If your meat's busting out of your folds... You know what, let me reword that. If you're so plastered that you can't even recognize if what you're eating can legally be classified as a sausage roll, it might be time for a talk. Right, I'm rolling, I don't know if you can see, but I'm rolling the sausage meat. Voice is going again. As you can probably see, I've got a tray with baking with grease, grease, them. Uh, greased. Yeah, it's greased again. See, my mouth is going again. Mouth running away with teeth again. Oh, this is going to be fun. I'm going to fold it over. If I can pick it up. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, it's crossed, it's crossed. I mean, it's done. I mean, it's folded over. And uh, there we have it. There's our sausage roll, people, which, if you weren't sure, is nothing but pastry and unseasoned frozen sausage meat. People of Britain, you guys really need to have a talk with Kay because at this point, the jokes are just writing themselves, and I've got to be honest, it's not a good look. When you don't even bother to put salt in what you're cooking, which for basically every dish on the planet is just as essential as, you know, cooking it, it's really hard to not start believing what people say about British food. When I shift my hand, I have made, oh I haven't made, I haven't made any, I've um, boiled two eggs. I'm gonna cut this, the, I can't even cut it, what's up with my strength today? Right, I'm going to flatten the sausage meat out. Now as I said, <clears throat> as I said, my rolling pin has gone somewhere so I'm using a substitute. So, uh, Kay, like I said, I'm not an expert on scotch eggs or anything, but I can't help but feel like we're using maybe a bit too much flour here when we're also going to be coating these in breadcrumbs. I feel like my hypothesis of this being the world's driest dish might be getting more and more accurate. Two scotch eggs and a sausage roll. Now I'm going to put them in the oven for 20 minutes and I am going to cook them on 200 for 20 minutes like I've just said. Oh, one thing I must remember. I've got to glaze the... Oh, it's 
got the sausage roll. I'm just going to glaze it with what bits of eggs left, so that should be okay, that should be okay. Alright, EK, a couple of concerns. I don't think this is the preferred method for egg washing. This more resembles some sort of method of making like an oven-baked omelet. Also, just said you were gonna cook these bad boys for 20 minutes. Uh, not only do I feel like there would probably be some differences in how long the sausage roll needs to be cooked and the scotch eggs need to be cooked, but baking a boiled egg for 20 minutes? Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and pat myself on the back saying that this is the driest thing humanity has ever created. Somebody needs to direct Niall Red to this video. I think I found him a new drying agent. There we are now. It's classed as glazed. It isn't. It's just had eggs poured all over it, but it's classed as glazed. So now, like I said, it's going in the oven on 200 for 20 minutes. You can see it's all come out. All done. They look nice. They look nice. That looks nice. Well, really nice. So, okay. I love you, I really do, but uh, nice is not the word I would use to describe what I'm seeing. This looks like two balls of poop and some sort of animal penis. I mean, is that too harsh? I don't know, but this doesn't even really look like food. There's no color. It's like I'm watching a black and white film. I'm looking at pictures of scotch eggs on Google and they're all brown, so I don't really know what happened here, but I feel like frying up a couple of eggs and then making a sausage patty would give you all the same flavor profiles as you'd get here, except, you know, better and much less hassle. Uh, I'm going to leave it to cool down a bit because I don't want Lee to burn his mouth. I know you'd like to see it on camera, but that's just being cruel. So I'm going to leave it to cool down a bit and then I'm going to let Lee taste a bit. So This is the end product of sausage rolls and scotch eggs. Alrighty, so am I going insane or are these scotch eggs bending space and time? Did you guys just see that? Witnessing this, I would warn Lee not to eat this, but we've seen what he could handle in the past, so I uh, don't think this is going to be a problem. It's still a bit hot, but Lee's decided... He's a brave lad. Guys, that egg yolk has turned a color I don't think I've ever seen a boiled egg turn. I've seen them go a little bit green, but that looks almost fully brown. Oh, well. <laughs> <laughs> what should we do first? You pick. I don't know, whatever you want. Pick, it'll be an hour long by the time you pick. <laughs> egg. Egg, egg. Got check. Yeah. Haha. <laughs> Because it's going to be as can't it with him. Apart from the taste buds being burnt to heck, but yeah, it is actually... It isn't burnt. No, my taste buds aren't half eating that because it's hot. <gasps> is it alright? Does it taste... No, it, ta right? it does taste nice, oh. yeah. It does taste Good. nice. Guys, seriously, have I been drugged? What is happening to this camera? I've watched a million case cooking videos and I've never seen this. Do I need to go to the hospital? Also, on a more related note, I don't think that the bite Lee got of that scotch egg had any actual egg in it. So the man basically just ate part of a turkey meatball and gave a thumbs up to the scotch eggs and you know what? I'm not gonna stand for that. I demand a recount. They are actually, they're both nice. They both are gorgeous. I'm not saying they taste like such well and um, scotch egg, but like I said, I didn't get really well, no, before you start giving me that nasty look, right, it's because they were really hot and burning me, so I didn't really I couldn't really get a taste. Okay, well, when, yeah, but yeah. like I said, the bit I did taste, they actually did taste like it, but it was really when you start looking at me like that <laughs> it, it like I said, only thing I could really taste was hotness, mm. but for the bit I did taste it actually did taste like them. So Thumbs up. Um, okay. I'm gonna level with you guys. I don't want to lie here. I did not catch any of that whatsoever. From what I could understand, I feel like it was positive. Right? Seemed like he did enjoy the sausage roll and the scotch eggs, but I would not feel confident in guaranteeing that. I'm gonna play it safe and say that Lee was just trying to appease his mother because he did not want to be wiped out of space. Because based off of the funky camera business we've been seeing, I feel like Kay has the ability to do just that. Well guys, what do you think? If you happen to be a scotch egg expert, please fill me in on how Kay did here. Also, let me know if you can find this video anywhere else on my channel because I really feel like I have talked about this before. Watching through it again, I'm starting to think that maybe I never did, but I feel like I would have seen that in product and I would have been firing out my recording software, so uh, I'm kind of lost. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like and walk on over to that subscribe button and touch it. It's free. It won't cost you anything. But for now, that's all I have for you today. Bye.